One of the challenges of having prophetic gifts and talking a lot to God and meditating is that sometimes that God asks you to do stuff and you really hear Him that you don't want to do. I can't really believe and don't really want to talk about this topic, but because I'm an oracle, because I'm a channel, because I honor the Lord, I will allow this to be channeled through me. I don't want to talk about slavery, but I have to talk about being a slave. Because people in my life have tried to turn me into their slave. And I don't like it. And people like to try to turn women and children into their slaves. All I know about slavery is the atro atrocious things that happen to people in abuses of people through slavery. And it pisses me off today that there are people, men and women, black and white, every color around the world that still want to turn people like me or you into slaves. We know from the history that slavery has been with us since antiquity. We absolutely know this. The sub-Mediterranean period of time, and I suck with history that far back. But I can tell you what I feel about this is that people are immoral. And your immoralness shows every time you try to put someone into a game where you can play with them. I can remember being on campus totally sound asleep, peaceful, happy, content, and safe. And some black man from a haircut shop wanted to walk up, swack, smack my feet to wake me up. Was he there to kindly give me some money so I could eat and not starve? No. He just wanted to talk to me. And I'm like, I'm in the middle of sleep, motherfucker. I don't walk into your fucking bedroom with your fucking wife and do this to you. The only people that would be allowed to do that in my household, anywhere in the world, would be my wife and my son. And plenty. And our cat, Aichan. But the, she did that a lot and I was allergic to her. Little tailless little shit. But we loved her until I said, enough, it's going to kill me. You'll have to give it away. And my wife was so mad at me that day because she was a stay nickel. Not to talk about that, but a stay nickel means to throw away cat. We found her in the park with our son. And my son would also crawl in bed with us too when he had a bad dream. And that was okay. That's what he can do. And that's what sons do. But you don't have the right to crawl in bed with me. You don't have the right to crawl in bed with anybody. And you don't have the right to tell people what they can and can't do marvelously with their body. And I might get a little off track for a little bit of comedy, but the reality is God is not pleased with you. God has told you, who the fuck are you thinking that you can sell somebody's body? Who the fuck do you think you are that you think you can take our country, motherfucking Mexicans, back to slavery? Slavery has existed throughout the world in every fucking nation practically since antiquity. And I'll repeat it again. But we came such a motherfucking long way through all sorts of suffrages of people that we don't do that today. And yet there are immoral people coming into our land that want to do that to us as if we don't have the right to be here in America and we don't have the right to our own individual self. And that's what pisses me off.